Hello, everyone. Welcome to Science Class with Teacher Prasanna again. Today, our topic is animal responses to stimuli. Animals respond to stimuli around them, such as sunlight, sounds, temperature, water, and touch. This helps animals to survive by adjusting the conditions in their environment. The first stimuli that animals respond to is light. Animals respond to light in different ways. For example, insects fly toward light or fire. Earthworms move away from sunlight. Chickens grow when the sun rises. Birds fly out of their nest in the morning to hunt for food and go back to their nest in the evening. Second, animal responses to sound. Animals respond to sound in many ways. For example, a bird is frightened and flies away when it hears a loud noise. Animal response to temperature. Animals need to live in the proper temperature. If the temperature changes, then the animal will respond to the change in temperature in order to be safe and survive. For a high temperature, the animal responds like this. For example, a dog will cool its body down by sticking its tongue out. A cat will cool its body down by licking its feet. A flock hibernates to keep itself cool. How is animal respond to low temperature? For example, a polar bear has big fur to protect itself from the cold. An Asian open bill migrates from Siberia to Thailand, which is a warmer place to find food. Animal respond to water. All animals need water to survive. However, some animals need to live in wet areas so that they can keep their skin moist. For example, if an earthworm gets too dry, it will move to the wet area. The last one, animal responses to touch. An animal's skin is sensitive to touch. The nerves and muscles are connected and work together to help the animal to move. For example, a millipede curls itself up when being touched. A toad expands its body when being touched. Let's review again animal responses to stimuli. First, light. Second, sound. Third, temperature. Fourth, water. Fifth, Bye, see you next time.